Football season is here, and what better way to prep fans for a game than with an easy yet impressive tailgate? The Grill Dads, Mark Anderson and Ryan Faye, a.k.a. Mark and Faye. Join me now via Zoom. Guys, how are you? How are you feeling? Great. How are you? Great. I'm yeah. good. I'm good. Excited to be speaking with the both of you. So, you know, I'm curious, Grill Dads, this kind of brand that the two of you have built together, how did this whole thing get started? Well, Mark and I met 27 years ago at some point in college. Uh, and then when I got an adult job, I moved to New York City. And then Mark would come through on business and start cooking and as a thank you. And so we just found our love of grilling at that point. We obviously grew up with that too. But we would we both lived in Los Angeles for a long time. And uh, as a result, we would cook outside every weekend, 15, 20, 30, 40. Oh, and 60 people would end up showing up to our backyards and eating our food. And someone said, Matt, you, you guys are pretty good at this thing. We, we, we were like, really? And so then we submitted a, a video. We actually had some some shows on the Food Network. And now we travel around talking to awesome people like you and working with great companies like Johnsonville. Yeah, yeah. I love that this very small kind of simple, very American idea kind of started in your backyards and now it's boobed into everything that it is now. So I'm kind of curious what your all stance is on the importance of having just a good recipe ready to go for a tailgate. Uh, uh, having a good recipe ready to go is important and having it prepped is important because you want to be able to relax and hang out with your friends and family as well. So the, the recipe that uh, we're, we're making this weekend is a Johnsonville sausage smash taco. So we're actually taking ground breakfast sausage. We hit it on the flat top. We smash it with a tortilla. We top it with an over easy egg, pico de gallo, crema, a little bit of sea salt, your favorite hot sauce. And then you've got this beautiful golden brown and delicious sausage topped with an egg. That yolk becomes the delicious <laughs> breakfast sandwich sauce. It is a handheld dreamboat of a tailgate experience. <laughs> yeah, um, I feel like I need to get my hands on that. So that sounds absolutely incredible. I am curious, though, with that, you know, it's a very detailed kind of in-depth recipe there that there's a lot of heart going into it. How do you all come up with these recipes that you end up making? Well, I come up with all of them. Mark's kind of my sidekick. So, you know, in general, I'm the star of the show. So Love that. I, that's not true. I, I think Mark came up with this one anyway. So, but yeah, no, we, it's the great thing about using sausage. It's so versatile. And so you can just experiment. And Mark and I always say, everything you do inside, we'll show you how to do outside. Mm. And it's really, really simple. Grilling is a tool, not a cuisine. So we're going to use the tool in many different ways uh, and start with sausage because it's it's so different and easy. And everything we do, you can get at your grocery store down the street. We're not so pinkies up that you've got a special order everything. Yeah. So. Okay. I love that though. Very practical, very you know easy to kind of work around, start with sausage and move on from there. So beyond that, any kind of advice you would just share with our viewership as far as, you know, kind of hosting that tailgate or looking for that perfect recipe goes? Because, you know, a lot of us have very busy schedules and it can be kind of hard to plan and fit that in. You know, the the number one thing to figure out is how to get everybody together. Yeah. And, and <laughs> you know, the, that's what the tailgate is about for us. You know, we want to have our friends and family. We want to have the game on and we want to create some some great memories and have some great laughs around some great food. So it, it's it's keep your focus on everybody having a great time and uh, and then throw sausage on the grill. The food's going to work itself out. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Now, you know, I'm curious too. my final question for you. You know, we spoke about how you started in this very simple kind of backyard idea and it's boomed into what it is. Did you ever think that by just kind of like being yourselves and using your own talents and what you're good at would get you to where you are today business wise? That's a, it, it, first of all, thank you for that question. It, it's amazing to us that this idea of being authentic and human is exceptional or special, but yeah. all we are is just the same guys that we've always been and we always will be. I think it was Mark's wife, who said one day, she's like, you idiots need to just put a camera on yourselves because we were behind the camera our entire careers. And we're like, well, we have faces for radio. That doesn't make any sense. So, however, we were able to kind of capture, I think, the hearts and minds of a really nice group of people that just want simplicity, levity, and good people, good fun. That's it. We're, that's what we're all about, which is why Keep It Juicy is so cool. Yeah, so. yeah, absolutely. When I think that what you just said, the good people, good fun is just as simple as it gets. Well, Mark and Faith, thank you both so much for taking the time to speak with me. So cool getting to speak with the grill dads. Check them out online. Thank you both.